This species is Corythosaurus. It's a duck-billed dinosaur and a plant-eating dinosaur. We had this skull that was collected from Dinosaur Provincial Park in 1920, and there was material collected, so other fossils, collected in 2012 that may or may not have belonged to it. And what I did was I took measurements of the different fossils we had and measurements of the skull and compared it to measurements of other similar dinosaurs and did statistical analyses of different kinds to see whether or not, for example, the femur, the leg bone that we have, would be the correct length to fit with a skull of this size. The skeleton was originally found in 1992, but at the time, it didn't look very remarkable. And it wasn't until 2011 that Darren Tanke from the Royal Tyrrell Museum found some archeological evidence in the debris, which was beside the site and there was some plaster, and then there were some newspaper clippings from 1920. And by process of elimination, it seemed like the only person collecting at the time was George Sternberg, and he's the one that collected the skull in 1920. So after it seemed like there's potential that the fossils belong to the skull, it was collected in 2012 by the University of Alberta, and that's when the whole process began with trying to figure out whether or not it belonged together.